Now to a potential breakthrough involving a company owned by Elon Musk and a brain implant that could dramatically improve the lives of thousands of people. ABC News' Andrew Dimbert has the details. This morning, Elon Musk announcing that for the first time, his company Neuralink has implanted a brain chip in a human. Musk saying the person is recovering well. Initial results show promising neuron spike detection. Neuralink's goal is to help paralysis patients communicate by connecting their brain to a computer. The device is designed to interpret your neural activity so you can operate a computer or a smartphone by simply thinking. People paralyzed from stroke, from traumatic brain injury, or a spinal cord injury could see the benefits. This would be a major game changer um, if it were to be proven to be safe and effective. The FDA approved Neuralink for human tests last May after years of testing on animals. Here's one electrode on one thread that when we stimulate clot causes a flexion movement of the leg. The company demonstrated the ability of its implants to stimulate movement. As you can see, Pager is amazingly good at mind pong. Allowing a monkey to play a video game. And what better reward for a monkey than a banana? Musk says the first human users will be people who've lost the use of their limbs. But speaking about the long term, he said, imagine if Stephen Hawking could communicate faster than a speed typist or auctioneer. That is the goal. I really do think that in my lifetime as a physician, I'll be able to use this type of technology to help my patients, and I cannot wait for that day to come. Neuralink's engineers aren't the only ones turning science fiction into reality. Researchers elsewhere help this man, paralyzed in an accident, walk again thanks to implants in his brain and spine. And in August, this woman, who had lost her voice to paralysis, was able to have a conversation with her husband again thanks to a mind-controlled avatar. Do not make me laugh. Andrew Dimbert, ABC News, New York. Experts warn much more testing and research is needed before any kind of widespread use of these devices. That can be a game changer and really be so impactful for people. I mean, we look at that's the sign of the times, the direction that we're heading in, but also a good thing as it relates to AI. Right, right? we'll just have to see as time goes on. Exactly.